He told us he relished a moment like this pregame, and tonight the senior lived up to his billing with the game-tying shot to send it into overtime. Jalen Coleman lands with 18 points in the 65-60 OT win for DePaul over Texas Tech. Jalen, first off, you had the shot of the game to send this into overtime. Take us through that moment. Sure. First of all, thank you for having me, John. Uh, it's crazy because I was talking to you before and now I'm talking to you after. But, I mean, honestly, I was just locked in the whole time from beginning to end, and I was just willing to do whatever it took, you know, to, to win a game. So uh, I'm grateful. You know, we came out. It was a great team, great Texas Tech team. Um, and, you know, I'm appreciative we came out on the other end, on the win side. So, How did this team pull it out? Uh, a lot of resilience um, and determination. Um, and I felt like it was a true test of our team and individually from each one of us. And it took a collective effort. Um, and I feel like I'm so proud of my team that we were able to do that. On the defensive end of the floor, every time you needed a stop tonight, you found a way to get it. Why is this group playing connected on the defensive end? Man, defensively, I feel like that's so much of just repetition and practice and like even off the court connection. Um, and I, I'm so like appreciative of my players, you know, my teammates, and I feel like it shows on the court. How much did you dream of a moment? Like the one just now with the students storming the court here. Man, I, it's crazy because I didn't even think it was on, you know, I, you dream of something like that, but uh, never do you think like, oh, today's going to be the day. You just got to, you know, like I said, relish in the moment and be locked in and be prepared for whatever. This group is now 9-0. and oh, yep. And tonight they found another way to win. You told me we just find ways. What about a team, Jalen, and this one that – is enabling you guys no matter what is going on that you just find a way to get a w because for this program they lost games like this in the past right um like i said it says a lot about the character um individually with our uh, with players and then as a whole holistically as a team and i feel like that that's so much off the court you know that's so much of you know making sure that communication is good and making and then on the court you know in practice repetition and then just really holding ourselves to that standard and it carries on so what was the locker room scene with Coach Slato after? Oh, man, he barely gave him time to speak because we was just so, you know, excited. And, um, you know, we, we knew how important this game was, and we felt it, you know, throughout the game, like how important each stop was and how pivotal it was. And, you know, it was right there. That's what, that, that's what builds camaraderie, and that's what kind of gives teams that edge to be the next level and to get to the standard where, where we're, we're trying to get to. Everyone's asking the question. And tonight, in a way, you answered it. I'll ask you. Yep. Is DePaul back? Um, I would like to say, yeah, we are. But it's a one game at a time. You know, it's not just, okay, we're back. It's, you know, preparation, how we handle stuff off the court, on the court, man, and practice. And it leads into the game. So it's an everyday grind. I think you got some phone calls and text messages to take. <laughs> something like that. Something like that. Go enjoy this. Congrats. I appreciate it. Thank you, John.